Today I'm going to make Breton butter cake with apricots. I'll put the list of ingredients on my video. You can pause the video, write them down, and then we'll get started. Give the butter out to soften at room temperature. We'll add the baking powder and the salt to the flour. We'll mix up the dry ingredients. We'll separate the eggs. We'll beat the egg yolks until they're nice and light. We'll add the sugar to the egg yolks. Then we'll whip the egg yolks and sugar together until they're nice and light. We'll mix the apricots, the sugar, the water, and the corn syrup in a pot. Then we'll cover it and simmer it. We'll cut the softened butter into pieces. We'll add the butter to the egg yolk and sugar mixture. And we'll whip the butter with the egg yolks and sugar until it's nice and fluffy. We'll add the dry ingredients into the butter mixture a little at a time. And each time, we'll stop and beat the butter mixture. Once we've whipped in all the dry ingredients, we have a nice thick batter. Once we've simmered the apricots, we take the lid off for a few minutes. And now the apricots are nice and plump and we have a little bit of glaze around them. We'll grease our tart pan with butter and line the bottom with wax paper. We'll spread half the batter out in the pan. We'll place half of our apricots on top of the first layer of the batter. Then we'll place the second half of the batter on top. Now we'll put the pan in the refrigerator to chill. We've chilled our dough for half an hour and we've made an egg yolk glaze with an egg yolk and a couple of teaspoons of water. And now we'll brush the top of the cake with the egg yolk. We'll even it out just a bit with a spatula and then we'll brush it one more time to use up the egg yolk glaze. We'll add a light dusting of sugar and then we'll arrange the rest of the apricots on top of the cake and bake it. We've been baking our Breton butter cake with apricots for a half an hour at 350 degrees. Uh, then we tented it with foil and baked it another 20 minutes at 350 degrees. And now we'll let it cool. Um, once it's cool, you can add the glaze um, that's left over from simmering the apricots, or we can sprinkle confectioner's sugar on it. So there you have it, Breton butter cake with apricots.